Hey, welcome to the Song Lounge with Chris Hardy. Good morning. It's early, isn't it? <laughs> welcome to this episode of the Song Lounge. I am Chris Hardy, having my coffee, still. Yes. It's not actually a work day. Uh, it's taping day. It's the day to record the Song Lounge. This is the place where I explain to you why I wrote that song. Oh, there really is a song over there. Check it out. It's a song off this album. This is the spillover effect. I did this in 2016. Yeah. And uh, if you can see the titles, one of those songs will be featured today. It's song number nine over, oh, oops, over here. It's called The Folk Singer Told Us. What did the folk singer tell us? I don't know. I don't really listen to folk music that much. Well, why did I write a song called The Folk Singer Told Us? Uh, if you know me, you know that I don't really like television. And I'm a little skeptical of the whole entertainment industry, even though I am part of it. A small part, but still part of it nonetheless. And I've written many songs over the years uh, to try and make people aware that uh, there's a lot of pollution involved in the entertainment industry. I, I kind of see it like food. You know, if, if you eat really good food, it's good for your body physiologically. Uh, if you watch really good entertainment, and who's to decide what's good? I don't know. It may not leave you feeling all dirty after watching it. There are certain shows that I've seen, uh, I watch them, and after, after watching them, I just feel like I need a shower or something, or a brain shower. Hey, now there's an idea for another anti-television song. Hmm. It's kind of like, you know, if you're going to eat crappy food with all kinds of crap in it, it will affect you. I mean, there's, there's chemical reactions in your body. And, and it's kind of the same thing with a lot of entertainment. It goes in, and then it does stuff to you. I can't explain what, because I am not a scientist. Okay, so when I wrote this song in 2016, um, I, I just, I had not come up with the full concept of it. It was just another anti-television song. And uh, I had this set of lyrics. They were pretty good, but they were really, really, really preachy. Am I fuzzy? I suppose I am. So I had these preachy lyrics, and, and I, I didn't want to be preachy. I don't want to stand here and say this to the world, so I had this brilliant idea. I came up with the idea of this fictitious folk singer. Because who better to preach than a folk singer? Maybe a preacher? Well, yeah, but a folk singer is kind of like a preacher set to music. Wow, isn't this exciting? Seems like my brain does need a wash, doesn't it? Go back to that brain shower thing. The folk singer told us we are watching terrible scenes as they play out on the screens and they fill up my heads to the top with the images that won't stop 
in and see all forms of human difficulty. Maybe it makes us feel secure while rendering us all impure. La 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 The folk singer told us That was that ninth chord I told you about. <laughs> uh, not commonly used in folk music. Well, that I know of. So there's that. Now you know the story behind the song The Folk Singer Told Us. Now, do you feel enlightened? Because I sure... Well, no, not really. It's I was just trying to avoid the blame of being preachy. It was the folk singer all along. You know, it's like the end of Scooby-Doo when they pull the mask off. It's the folk singer! Yes, it is, and I would have gotten away with it if it weren't for you meddling kids! That wraps up yet another episode of the Song Lounge. This is the place where I explain why I write the songs that I write. Because everybody wants to know, uh, and why settle for secondhand information when you could have it straight from the source, huh? Because I'm the one that did that. Oh crap, I could be accepting the blame with that statement alone. No, uh, uh, the folk singer did that. You know, that folk singer guy. Yeah. So anyway, my name is Chris Hardy. I urge you, if you like what I'm doing, to subscribe. Uh, please subscribe. Uh, share it with your friends. Post the link everywhere on your social media. Let everyone know why I wrote that song. From the Chris Hardy World Headquarters, I'm Chris Hardy. She'll see you next time on the Song Lounge, eh? 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 Are you there? Are you there? Look at that. Look at that.